Hi, I'm Maverick, a Build.com project expert, and welcome to our FAQ series, Glad You Asked. Today's question is what type of bathtub is right for my bathroom remodel? You have a lot of decisions to make when you're planning a bathroom remodel, and one of the most important is what type of bathtub to choose. Now, if you're not changing the footprint of your bathroom, you'll probably just replace the bathtub with something similar to what you already have. This is usually the least expensive option because you won't have to pay a contractor to move the plumbing. If you're starting from scratch or if you've budgeted for rerouting the plumbing, then you'll have more options. Here are eight different types of tubs that you should know about when planning your remodel. Clawfoot tubs are a type of freestanding tub, which means that they don't have to be installed against a wall or in an alcove. These particular tubs rest on four feet, whereas other freestanding tubs typically sit directly on the floor. This bathroom was designed with a lot of very classic, traditional elements, including this clawfoot tub. And though in this set we did place the tub in an alcove, it could have been positioned anywhere in the room as long as you could run plumbing to it. Another type of freestanding tub is the Japanese soaking tub. These deep, round tubs typically have a smaller footprint than other styles. Not only are these a great option for smaller bathrooms, they're also a really striking design element. Alcove tubs are an installation style that most of us are more familiar with. And as the name implies, the tub is built into an alcove made up of three walls. It's a space-saving design, and in smaller bathrooms, the alcove is usually at the far end of the room. And they often have a tile or acrylic wall so they can double as a shower stall. Corner tubs are usually installed against two walls and can maximize space by placing the longest measurement at an angle in the corner of a room. Next, let's take a look at two types of tubs that are built into surrounds. The first is the drop-in tub. And just like the drop-in sink, this type of tub is set into an opening with a surround with the lip of the tub sitting above the surface of the deck. Undermount tubs are also installed in a surround, but the lip of the tub is below the surface of the deck. Finally, let's take a look at two types of tubs that are all about the features. First, the jetted tub. Designed for ultimate relaxation through hydrotherapy, these tubs feature ports that shoot out jets of water or air and massage sore muscles and anky joints. Next, a walk-in tub can be a great solution for people with mobility issues. Walk-in tubs allow you to easily enter the tub and safely sit on a built-in bench. These tubs come in a variety of sizes and can often fit into the footprint of your existing tub. Most walk-in tubs include jets for hydrotherapy, and many come with options like built-in hand showers or color-changing lights for chromotherapy. Those are eight different types of tubs to consider for your bathroom remodel. For more great tips on choosing the perfect bathtub, check out our buying guides by clicking the link below. And visit build.com to shop for everything you need for your next project. And if you found this video helpful, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe to our channel. And tune in next time when we answer a new question on Glad You Asked. Thanks for watching.